Simon and I sort of started working together and he was trying to find scripts for me that I might be good for and trying to send me things from Los Angeles that I could maybe do a treatment on or try and get, you know, just have a meeting with someone. One of the scripts I sent Jamie was, I know what you did last summer. And Jamie responded like, I, I have to shoot this movie. And I was like, well, let me try and get you in on that. So, you know, we contacted the producer Neil and the executives with, with Silent Number and, you know, it just wasn't like, you know, passing, passing the bar at that point because they're starting to meet, meet filmmakers. So Jamie said, I, I'm going to shoot a trailer. I thought, well, I've got 10 minutes of 35 millimeter film stock. I could probably afford to get that processed and developed and, and cut a little trailer together. I thought I'll just go through and find all the moments out of that script that would probably make the real trailer. And I'll just shoot those bits only. So that's what I did. I went out over two weekends with some actors and some film school buddies and we shot this trailer for I Know What You Did Last Summer. I sent it in the mail, crossed my fingers and hoped for the best. When he sent it back in, it was just amazing. It was like, this is the movie. This is what it looks like. Raced, I think I drove it over there to, to Neil's office and dropped it off. When I was going to make I Know What You Did Last Summer, uh, we were meeting all kinds of new directors and uh, uh, we had settled on Jim Gillespie when out of the blue something arrived at my office and it was a trailer for the movie I Know What You Did Last Summer, which I just thought was absolutely terrific. And I actually remember thinking, God, did I make the wrong decision? Did I, did I just hire somebody? Too early. This was like this was what the movie what we wanted that movie to be, and I actually saw it there on film. So he cuts a trailer for I know you did last summer with an entire Australian cast, <laughs> and it was genius. I mean, it was genius. It was like which I think they kind of copied a lot of the stuff he did when they actually made the trailer for I know you did last summer. I thought that he would be the perfect choice for this movie, which he, he which he was. Once I saw that tape, for me, Jamie was really the, the lead, and after speaking to him, also got to know he's a true horror aficionado. So that just blew me away. And, um, you know, other people came in and talked about it, but we really all got behind Jamie. Some of them sent me Jamie's short film and his trailer, and um, I loved it. We met, loved his infectious personality, and then we suddenly had this script and immediately I thought of Jamie. And I think probably Brad called me and goes, you know Jamie Blanks? And I'm like, do you know Jamie Blanks?